We're going to be looking at some of the best sandbox maps ever made. These maps are so detailed, I can't tell if I'm looking at a computer game or real life. So this is Office. This is made by Backscratch. It's a recreation of the Counter-Strike Office map. This is so realistic. It's like I'm actually in an office. It's full of interactable physics props too. Let's go to the kitchen. This is... Wow, this is wild. Here, this is the projector room. This is so interesting. They have a movie here. Oh, you cast a shadow on it. It's actually a projected texture. Oh, there's a picture of the map's development. So the outside of this map was recently updated. I can shoot through the window and go outside. Look at these big towers. This is crazy. Wow. Oh, I found you. Hello. It looks like they've closed the road here. I think you can get to the other side. Is that where you came from? Uh, yep, yeah, that's where I came from. I feel like that's different than the original. Whoa, there's a, a platform? Oh, you can't actually go here, but you can if you're a no club. Mannequin building. <laughs> can I go inside? Wow. I, this is, wow. Hmm. Can I jump over this fence? Oh, I can. I have escaped. Let's check out the garage. Garage with the red light. Oh, this isn't a physics prop. That's a, oh, it is a physics prop. I can't, I guess it's too heavy. Oh, I've exploded. How did you explode? <laughs> oh, you threw the prop. Last time, I think you could walk straight through these fences, but that's been fixed. Here's the outside of... The Wait, this is where I already was at. Look at this giant door. What is this? I have no idea. Maybe it's supposed to be like a warehouse building. Is there a underground section? Oh. This is revolutionary. Okay, next map. I actually haven't even seen this map yet. You haven't? It's great. Uh-uh. This map is Chateau. This is a mini golf map by Eagle One. These statues look so realistic. Oh, look at the props underneath the um, the floating rocks. Oh, the, the spinny bits? Yeah, they're like yeah. little helicopters. So this is a big floating rock island thing. Do the props kill you if you fall into them? Oh, you, know, you can stand on it. <gasps> oh, it's... <laughs> so this map is full of great looking statues. This map just looks fantastic in general. There's even doors on this map. I can't believe it. If you go out beyond the walls, the, the, the big stone walls at the edges, you can see the entire map through the wall. Oh, interesting, yeah. So these walls must be a skybox. So if I stand on it, I'll just go right through it, yep. I'm actually really impressed by this map. This is my first time seeing it. It's great, I was, I was blown away. Here is a entrance hall with interesting looking statues, wow. But the reflections on here, yeah, they're, they're crazy. So realistic. Beautiful. I can't tell if I'm looking at a real statue or a video game. Ooh, there's gargoyle pillar statues. Maybe they'll come alive and haunt your dreams. I really like the, the chandeliers in this area. They look very cool, very interesting. How about the flags? You get some of the wavy flag action? Oh yeah, the wavy flag and the... This this is an interior room though. There shouldn't really be that much wind in here. I don't know why this flag is waving so much. Can I drive my car on the mini golf course? Oh, I can. Imagine if there was a racetrack in Sandbox. Um, very well done to the Eagle One team. Very beautiful map, I love it. So this map is Climb by Willow. It's a unicycle frenzy map and it's set on a small island. So I guess there isn't really much to look at here. We have, there's a hidden cave. You can uncover the secrets. Oh, I found it. Yo, this music. Wait, is this part of the map? Yeah, it is. It's oh. the comforting cockroach. <laughs> oh no, the comforting cockroach. So one thing that we really like about this map, when playing it on Unicycle Frenzy, is yeah. if you come to the start, when you just get past the start, you're down here, and you can see people above you who have made further progress. I wonder, hmm, you might even be able to see people way up top. I love jumping off the mountain every time I beat this map. I'm just Great. crashing. There is one thing I want to point out on this map is there is some floating grass by the start and there's no um, kill triggers in the water. I've always wondered if this is a skip that you can do here. I mean, it looks like it should be, but it looks at this first hard. Part? Yeah. Ooh. Definitely is a skip. Uh, there was another skip I wanted to try where you go really fast around the mountain. You just go in circles and build up speed and like right up the side of one of these rocks no way. somewhere. I haven't found like the perfect route yet. But there's got to be something. It kind of where I kind of like went up a little. Yeah, uh, like I bet there's a skip somewhere. That would be just totally wild if somebody manages to do that. I think it's time for the next map. So this is Metro. I made this. It's still a work in progress, and it has some anomalies in the map, it's like missing textures. So it's set in a destroyed metro station. Look at these flames. 
That's so realistic. I can't believe there's just burning debris. Oh, did you do photos of the blocking? Is that what these are? Or is it something else? You can... You can see it? I can see, like, blocking photos. Oh, I think you're... I think you're on the old version of the map, and I'm on the newest version. So. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm going uh, through the ground. <laughs> oh, yeah, so you just, you just must be the local version. I thought I uploaded this. Um, I guess it didn't work. Yeah, this is Deville. He made this old version of the map. Oh, I see. <laughs> I put it here as a, a tribute to his hard work. So this map probably looks completely different for you. I don't know how old it is. Interesting. Do you see the hole in the ground here? The grates? Yeah, I see the grates and like pipes running through. Do you see it, it moves? So you definitely see the physics wrap. I guess I can try walking through stuff. And if I can walk through it, then you can't see it. How, do, how does this tunnel look for you? For me, it looks very realistic. It looks very unrealistic for me. Oh. Very, very unfinished. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, it looks a little more finished to me. There's like a hole in the wall here. I really like the missing textures. Uh, do you see missing textures on like the machines? Nope, no missing textures here. Oh, I wonder that I must be able to walk through it. I really like the debris pile right here. The edge of this tunnel here. Doesn't this look so realistic? Yeah, it looks beautiful. Thanks. 20% reflectivity. <laughs> Is that what it's, it's not even a, the texture? <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's wild. I'm gonna go upstairs up the escalators. Very detailed. Oh. Oh, right. I I raised the floor. So on my screen, we're like, we're sunken into the floor. Beautiful map, Gavardos. I love it. Oh, uh, thank you. <gasps> oh, this map looks great. There's even like little pirate ships out here. This is so realistic, wow. This map is so cool. There we go. Looking pretty good, right? Ooh, uh, oh, it's looking beautiful. It is, <laughs> it's like 100% missing textures for me. Yeah. You too? Yeah. <laughs> it's beautiful. Wow. Ocean, wow. This is so cool, wow, okay. This map is Cypress by Eagle One. It looks very realistic. Wow, this is insane. Look at the detail. Look at these uh, things. Wait, they're not connected. Aren't they supposed to be connected here? They are supposed to be connected. Huh. Mm. <sighs> Unbelievable. No, I like the I like the I like the aesthetic of this map. It's like it's mildly cartoony, like hand painted style. I love that. It's great. Yeah. So this is a, a racing map for Grand Prix. We can see there's a couple missing textures on here, but there's our booster pads from the racing game. It's just missing the skybox. Oh yeah, the skybox is black. I guess the skybox is also from the game. I'm gonna drive my car on the track. This is so interesting. Wow. Oh, the wheels aren't spinning. Huh. Interesting feature. Look both ways before crossing the street. There aren't any crosswalks in this map, so I guess this isn't really a pedestrian zone. Like, you're not supposed to be walking <laughs> here. These trees are so realistic. It's like I'm actually looking at an oak log. So this is Utopia DM by Willow. This is a deathmatch map, and it's commonly used for Instagib. Instagib is a great game mode. Instagram is great. It has a water fountain feature here. This is so realistic. It's like, look at the particle effects. Wow, it's like I'm actually in water. Oh, this map's got like the Fall Guys style with this this plastic stuff on the bottom here. Oh yeah, Can I think that. this is meant to be like paintball uh, barriers. This is insane. 